So our platform has four main topics. So we have student life, campus resources, um, communi communicate a community, and then um, future. Focusing on social life, I think you know, as grad students, we there really is a disconnect between you know us and the campus community. So we're going to focus on really making sure grad students feel connected to the university. And then campus. Um, so one of the things is graduate students live in a lot of different places. Mm -hmm. um, so transportation and parking is an issue. So just looking at alternative means for grad students who work quite different hours um, than undergrads um, and getting them to and from where they need to go. Mm -hmm. Then community. Yes. Um, so students here at UT Austin, especially graduate students, we're not just part of the 40 acres, but we're mm -hmm. part of a larger community. So um, we are in the midst of one of the best cities, uh, mm -hmm. Austin, Texas. And I think partnering with um, different agencies within the Austin community, mm -hmm. I think would be really beneficial to um, to both grad students and, uh, mm -hmm. and the city that we live in. Another portion of our platform is uh, communication. So. Um, we just want to make sure grad students know what's going on. Uh, I think if you if you check the UT uh, U Texas GSA website, unfortunately a lot of it's outdated. Their Twitter, their Facebook page, it's not really updated. So we want to make sure that we have a grad student calendar that students can go to the UT U Texas GSA website and see you know what events are going on this week for any grad student, any groups. The last big platform topic and one of the platform points under that is future and under futures innovation. So something that you know is near and dear to my heart is uh, incubator space on our campus. I mean we're in Austin, it's the Silicon Valley South, right? So we have we're a tech hub, and it's we're really booming. So I think having an incubator on our campus Campus where student entrepreneurs can get together and uh, share ideas, share visions, meet with Austin-based mentors, meet with faculty, um, and just get their startups going on the right uh, direction, I think would be... We're really a leading cool. research university, right. and this is something that most of the other leading yeah. research universities right. have, so um, in order to keep pace with them, it's mm -hmm. an important uh, thing I think we should have. So I think, you know, in that respect, we do have both sides. We have someone that knows a lot mm -hmm. about UT, has worked in student government, mm -hmm. um, so knows the people, has relationships with a lot of the people, has um, seen projects through, mm -hmm. has seen, you know, what kind of roadblocks happen and what kind of red tape and has had that experience. Mm -hmm. Um, I think from my perspective, being sort of an outsider, it's having that objectivity of like, why, why are things working this way? Um, or maybe, you know, things could be different. I would say just the disconnect between the UT community and graduate students at large. I think, you know, you go to graduate students and you ask them, you know, do you know what's going on on campus? Do you know anyone outside of your cohort? Do you know X, Y, and Z about campus? And most of them will say, no, not really. This is, this is what we do. Right. This is what we're studying. This yeah. is not a part-time thing for us. Mm -hmm. um, so this isn't something that we would be doing on the side every day. I wake up and we read and study right. about higher education. Me and Francesco, both of us will delve right into it and put forth all the effort we need to put forth to get through all our platform points. We're very passionate about graduate students. We're very passionate about the University of Texas at Austin. And I think that will show through our campaign and hopefully through our tenure in GSA.